Hey fam, you know where you are. I'm sure you know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures. Too. Right here, you're watching Nollywood Pictures right here on YouTube for the best of African content and drama. Nollywood Pictures TV. Nollywood Pictures TV. My name is Frederick Leonard and I'm wishing you a Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year. God bless you. I love you all. time for me. Ikena is threatening. And my husband is not even ready to give up. What am I supposed to do? I don't know what to do. It's okay. This is just too much for me alone. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? It's okay. I'm <laughs> I'm tired. I'm broken. I, 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 don't, I don't even know what else to do. I, I don't know.
lie to you. I am your father. <laughs> you are not my father. Don't say that. Okay, don't we look alike? No! Okay. I know you're very disappointed right now. But I am your dad. I cannot lie to you. I've got huge plans for you. Look, in the next few weeks, you will be traveling to America with me. Mm? So relax. You're with your dad. You have nothing to worry about. Stop crying. Mm? All right. So let's chat, big boy. What's your name? My name is Chidi. 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 That's a beautiful name. Mm? For a handsome boy like you. Mm? So Chidi, very soon you will be called a U.S. boy. Hmm? My mommy, I want my mommy. I don't want to go with you. No, that's, that's, not, that's not a problem. You, you, your mom can join us, okay? If that will make you happy, your mom can join us. No. We all will be I'm a child, but the blood of sisterhood run through me. But you have suffered a lot. When she has the lion as a father, Ozema mother come to pay and left. And you hated Ozema for nothing she knew about. Because I'm sure at seven years, Ozema would not have come to anything. Mother. Ujima is having issues in her marriage. She needs you. She needs us. Her life is in danger. As you see, your first and only grandson has been whisked away by an unknown person. What? 
Who's your last song? Quest away? By who? It happened before me. Because I used the money you gave to me to travel to our house. Who's your mind is I'll be crying day and night. Father, you know that peace with a member of your cabinet. Not at peace with your in-laws. You should be a leader, not a destroyer. Your great grandfather sat on this too. Your father stood so before you. And I feel I beg of you. Please, let me just the vanity of power. Oh, your man should not die. She made a mistake, huh? <laughs> <laughs> So, my daughter. <laughs> That idiot came into my compound, kidnapped my son. Tell him to bring him back. Tell Ikenna to bring my son back, else hey, the earth will shake. I'm just hearing this one for the first time. Maybe until I find out, please, you can now leave my compound. Oh, you want to find out? <laughs> you want to find out if my son was truly kidnapped? You want to find out? <laughs> ah! Tell Iken now to bring back my boy. Oh, if you give me one more reason to come back here, I swear to you, I'm going to burn down this caricature tent. Right. I'm telling you. That is you Try it. If you have the opportunity to Try come back it. again. What nonsense is this? Shouting him what out. Why are you giving me a hundred dollars to come back out like a madman? You know what I'm not saying? I don't blame you. Maybe in those days when my head is so hot, I will use much effort on you. Of course. <laughs>
my son. Produce him now. Where is my son? What the hell are you talking about? You took my son with you. Where is he? And your husband has upgraded from a thief to a kidnapper. He broke into my house this morning and kidnapped my son. Where is he? I broke into your... What are you... What nonsense are you vomiting? I broke into your house. Oh, don't even pretend. My son cannot go magically missing. You know his whereabouts. Where is he? Ikena. Well, hold on a second. Where is my son? Ikena. Ikena. What are you saying? What, what are you saying? My son is missing. Honey, wait, 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 wait. Are you telling me that my boy is missing? If thing happens to my boy, I swear to you, I will take you out. Hey, hey, hey! Where is he? You, you know where that boy is? You know? Don't shut up, my okay? What stupid game are you people playing? Where is my son? You took him. You took him. You broke in here and took my boy away from me. Where is he? You are looking at a suicide bomber. If you don't produce my son, I will burn every living thing in this house, excluding my son. If he's here, where is my son? He doesn't have your son. Where is he? Where did you keep him? Why would you even accuse my husband of taking your son? He doesn't know where you live. My point exactly. How could he have taken your son? How? Where is my child? Where did you take him to? I'm asking you, where is my son? Seriously, I don't get it. I'm finding this very hard to believe. If they claim they don't have him, then who? I'm as confused as you are, bro. There's no way they will discover this place and take this boy away. Are you suspecting anything? Possibly adopted him. I don't know. I don't know. This is somehow. Who else has interest in the boy apart from the three of you? Take the words out of my mouth. Who else has interest in my son apart from the three of us? He can. Oh, yes. He can. He knows something. He is behind the disappearance of Chidi. He's just covering up. Oh yes, he is just covering up as far as I'm concerned. Okay, we need to calm down. Huh. We need to take this easy. Uh. Ike is not that kind of person. I grew up with him. I know him that much. I mean, this same man cannot be asking for the custody of this child and claim that this child is missing. Don't you get it? He is not that kind of person. He won't do it. I have a feeling Chidi ran out of the house. Out of fear, I can't hold him hostage. Please. Really? You know him? That well? Uzama, so after all the years, this boy spent abroad, did all sorts of illegal business. Spent time in jail, came out, traveled back to this country. You still trust him this much, even with the life of your son? Is that something I should know? Oh, wait. Why did it not hit me that you wittingly gave my son to Ikenna, your boyfriend? Why did it not hit me? Tony, Tony, you would stop this right now. How? Why, why would you even think I would do such a thing? Why are you defending him? I am not defending him. Why do you trust him so much? Why would I give my child out to a man? This man has been out of your life for so many years. 
Now hold on a second. What is going on here? Tony, no. E enough. I'm beginning to look like a suspect all of a sudden. Am I not? That's not true. You know that. Listen, Tony, I understand the frustration stemming from the recent development, but please do not add to your wife's miseries. Please. Okay? <laughs> A lot of waters have passed the ocean. A lot happened in the past due to excessive anger. But we can't remain perpetual enemies because of all that. It was because some of us could not control our actions. Yes, I married your sister. And things went the way it did. But then, I get all my actions. Your Majesty, my being a Bukhuruk but notwithstanding, I am a very peaceful person. And I'm sure you can acknowledge that. Yes, yes. It is my peaceful nature that made me to keep coming to the palace from time to time. When Uzioma grew up, she requested to know her father. At a point, I had no option but to appoint you the biological father. That was why she kept coming to the palace. But you rejected her. So it was this rejection that made her to exhibit those nasty attitudes that were repugnant to you. Hmm. The climax of it all was when you declared her wanted. She had no option but to run for her life. Then the issue of marriage came and all the other stories that followed. Hmm. At this point, let me ask you a question. And that one an answer. Did you later collect Briar Price from her husband? How can I? Uh, am I the biological father? Thank you. May the gods keep you. <sighs> Chizaram. Chizaram told me a lot about that sister of hers. Hey. I've not done my work very well as a, a family man and as a Father, or oh, I king. Hey, I've heard a lot. I need to make amends with everyone. So that at my right time, when it is time for me to go down six feet, I'll have to sleep with my ancestors peacefully. That is a very good decision, Your Majesty. I need a very good decision. Seriously. Um, you see. She's around. Good things will never depart her way. You see? I mean, she was the only person who thought it wise to consistently ask of her sister. Each time she came, she would bring food items, money. I mean, she was so caring. Something that her elder sister never thought of doing. I mean, God will continue to bless that young girl. He said, I have not much to say, but please forgive my daughter, Ju, and others for talking to you the way they did. 
And I can say, no, who's that one man? I'm not doing it. Hmm? Who's that one man? Do God. Hmm? Thank you. Thank you. Let him find color for you. Oh, you and him. Now, who do you really think is the father of that boy? Stop it! Stop it, Kidna. You think you haven't hurt me enough? Do you know what I have been going through? Do you think I am happy to be committed to another man? Do you know the pains? The pains I went through? Oh, please. Don't even start with that blame games. Like it was my fault, of right? Of course it was your fault! Really? It was all your damn fault! Do you know the trauma I went through when I heard about your arrest? Oh, really? Like it was my fault, right? Was that why you easily forgot about me? Few weeks after my arrest and got involved with another man? Was that how little I was worth to you? Was that how little you loved me? You couldn't even wait for a leap year before running into another man's arms. Was that how cheap you were? Shut up! Shut up. 